First and second positions up for grabs. Afridi on the charge. Yes, has he got all of it? Yes, he has. A six to finish off the over. Takes them to 87 for six. And also, we'll have a cool and cool strategic time. He's bowled so short all the way through these four overs. Now he bowls a full toss. Where's that gone? That's gone into the stands and he's caught it. Pepsi catch across, got another one as we reach the 201 mark in the HBL Tournament Sixes. He's got this amazing ability to hit sixes shot up for the end. That was an easy shot for him to play, a full toss. And well caught, sir. Well done. It's a one-handed take. Yeah. Easy shot for Afridi. Got the angle right. Wasn't even looking at the ball. Wasn't bothered. The moment he middled it, he knew it was going to go. He hasn't bowled well. Comes the ball, the 18th over. One for 19 off three, pulled on a couple of short deliveries at Hafiz who feasted on them. Very critical time now in bowling to Shahid Afridi. Timal Mills still has one over, so moving him back. Thirty-one required of the last three. It's got to be precise because anything short will be dispatched of Hafiz has already, as I said, dealt with three short balls when he was at the crease facing Nawaz. It's an appreciable turn if you just join us. It ain't over yet. Lovely strike, Shahid Afridi. Boundary of the first ball. 100 comes up. It is special from Afridi. How he exposed the stumps and yet could find the angle down the ground. Lovely shot was the Yorker leg. It was bold at a faster pace, targeting his, his toes. And have a look at that beautiful elevated drive. Very animated, Kitty. He wants another man down the ground. So there's a straight, very straight long off. And a long off, which is a little squarer. We saw that kind of field set against Pollard as well. He says he, he wants a bit of... Uh, well, he's, he's standing in front of the side screen. That is what Afridi is telling the umpire. He can't see the baller properly or the ball properly because of the, of the fielder there. KP stationary, not moving. At six, Shahid Afridi on the money once again. Rampant here in Dubai in the top tier. Well, this is a huge hit that's gone into the top tier here in Dubai. Kept his balance. 93 meters. Let's have a 
question for you two guys. Put your bowling caps on or your batting caps, whichever one you want. Should he be trying to fire the ball up in there or should he use the pitch a little bit more and allow the ball to turn away from a freely from a length? You liked? Mamadoula, you're right, Bish. It's going to be Mamadoula. And seven needed. A Freedy is on strike. I'm going to look on one side of the ground. It's over there towards mid wicket. Oh, he hits it in the gap. Shahid Afridi, boom, boom, has shown up tonight again. Yeah, they're loving every bit of him. Yeah, it's been a very emotional run chase. We agree. Shahid Afridi, they're finding the gap and finding great form when Zalmi needed one. Yeah, he's all pumped up. Three runs of five balls. And it is now. They're over the line, the Zalmis. They've chased it down. Afridi loves it. And we love him too. A remarkable comeback by Zalmi. They were going nowhere with this frantic run chase. And eventually, they're over the line. Courtesy Shahid Afridi's brilliance with the bat. 45 from 23. It's just an, a very, very emotional run chase for the fans, for the team as well. They were 52 for the loss of six, and they're over the line in the last over. 19.2 balls, 130 for eight. Zalmi win this. And they qualify either to be the leaders or at number two slot in the playoffs. They'll probably play play the playoff in charge on Tuesday. Celebration in the crowd for the Zalmi supporters. Oh, she has shown all the emotion here tonight with the Bucks Bunny in her arms. He has come through for you. And not Bucks Bunny, I mean the man above. Oh, what emotion the supporters go through. Sometimes as a player and a former player, you really forget how much fans invest themselves into their franchise team or their national team. What a win. They almost, almost, but for Shahid Afridi, they almost threw it away. They made hard work of it. Hassan Ali not to be outdone either. A vital two boundaries off the penultimate over bowled by Timal Mills. <laughs> He's seen it. He's done it before. Shahid Afridi. Spares it's shaping to be a close finish here. Mind that first and second positions up for grabs. Afridi on the charge. Yes, has he got all of it? Yes, he has. A six to finish off the over. Takes them to 87 for six. And also, we'll have a cool and cool strategic time. He's bowled so short all the way through these four overs. Now he bowls a full toss. Where's that gone? That's gone into the stands and he's caught it. Pepsi catch across, got another one as we reach the 201 mark in the HBL Tournament 60s. He's got this amazing ability to hit sixes, Shada Fridi, and that was an easy shot for him to play, a full toss. And well caught, sir. Well done. It's a one-handed take. Yeah, easy shot for Afridi. Got the angle right, wasn't even looking at the ball wasn't bothered the moment he middle it he knew it was going to go he hasn't bowled well comes to ball the 18th over oh, 
One for 19 off three, pulled down a couple of short deliveries at Hafiz who feasted on them. Very critical time now in bowling to Shai Dafridi. Timal Mills still has one over, so holding him back. Thirty-one required of the last three. It's got to be precise.